love factor has been severely lacking in social networking and Picnic Village intends to play its part in putting that right. I'm interested in possibilities for social change and how interaction can facilitate this. There's no reason at all why we shouldn't start from a utopian viewpoint. I'd like to think Picnic Village could become a model for the sort of community that the web is currently lacking. Most of all, I'd hope that people will be inspired by an environment of warmth, human interaction and common purpose. Funded, owned and driven by its own members, Picnic Village will have a progressive constitution which excludes advertising in favour of subscription. Free registration to the site will be available. You'll only get the full functionality when you subscribe to the community. Picnic Village will help unearth each person's unique and special qualities and help them to fulfil their potential personally, spiritually and financially. I can give you an idea of the diversity of Picnic Village just by naming a handful of the many guilds that you can join up to. Relationships, technology, business, urban, camping, desire, health, fashion, food and drink, built brand, folklore, politics, wibble. The idea is that the community will engage an editorial team who will highlight the most interesting and groundbreaking newsworthy content on the site. All members can become both editors and moderators, as well as being the critic, the chooser, the endorser and the link builder. We'll be polling our members on the big issues of the day, and I expect there to be a campaigning element in what we do too. It's not just an online social network, it will exist offline too. What we're talking about here is a unique opportunity to be part of an exciting new community whose founder members have a degree of control. We're just getting the ball rolling really. What happens next is down to the community.